Welcome back to Rational Table Tennis Analysis. In this video, we'll focus on how to play against long pimples. Long pimples are very common within amateur players, and often people struggle playing against them as they don't understand how long pimples work and they're not used to it. At the professional level, long pimples are rare to see, but still, there are some top players in the world. Monica Batra is a great example. She constantly twiddles between her long pimple and her normal rubber to confuse the opponent and also to change the rhythm of the rally. In this video, we'll talk about the sequence of long pimples, tactics to beat them and also the mindset you need when playing against them. First of all, you need to understand the rule of long pimples and how it operates. When you do a topspin shot, your opponent chop the ball, it is always going to be backspin. If you're confident, you can loop the ball. If you're not, and you push, the next ball will become topspin. So basically, topspin will be converted to backspin, and vice versa. Just keep in mind that long pimples return the opposite spin, and try to get used to the sequence. With that being said, you need to have a deep understanding of the spin and know what spin your shot is creating. The mind is important when playing against long pimples. Make sure not to confuse yourself. The more topspin you put in your shot, the more backspin you're going to get in return. If you can loop heavy backspin, you can push the ball. The next ball will be topspin and you can attack again. When you push heavy, the next ball is going to float a bit. Make sure you watch the ball carefully and wait until the ball drops. Then play your topspin with good spin and control. Now that you understand how long pimples operate, we'll talk about tactics to beat long pimple players. The most important thing is that you need to know what your strengths are. If you are better at attacking against backspin, then you'll want to force your opponents to return backspin to you. If it's the opposite, and you are better at attacking against topspin, you want to force your opponent to return topspin to you so you can attack easily. This is the thing that you can control. For example, let's say you are better at attacking backspin. You can serve a fast long topspin to your opponent's long pimple and then be ready to attack the backspin in the next shot. Sometimes the ball from your opponent could drop heavily if it has heavy backspin so make sure you maintain a very good body position and play the topspin loop with nice control. This tactic suits player who can loop against backspin well. What can you do if you can loop well? You can emphasize on topspin. Here's how you do it. You serve a short backspin. When the opponent pushes the ball, the spin becomes topspin and you can be ready to attack. The return from your opponent might fluctuate and float a bit, so keep in mind to take your time, wait for the first bounce and then attack with brushing contact to increase the possibility of the shot landing onto the opposite side of the table. Often it is not easy to finish the rally with one attack or one loop shot. It is important to be patient and wait for your chance to come. Do not lose points easily, keep the consistency of your attack and then play a kill shot when appropriate. Most long pimps players chop or push much better with their backhand than their forehand, so make good use of your placement. Long fast serve to wide corners is always a good tactic to surprise your opponent and attack in the next shot. When you don't have a chance to attack, make sure you stay in the rally. When you feel this is the chance, then you can add power to your shot. Again, it is not easy to win the point with only one or two attacks. Consistency is key. The sequence of long pins is fixed and it is always going to be the opposite spin. As you play against long pimples more, you'll start to get used to the sequence and you'll find it not that difficult to play against. Anyway, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. I hope this video gives you a deeper understanding on how long pimples work and how to play against them. If you haven't already, make sure to check out this video on how to read spin as this could be helpful for you to play against long pimples. You can find the link in the top right corner.
If you found this tutorial useful, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and share it amongst your friends. Feel free to comment below if you have any questions or suggestions on what videos to do next. I've lots of videos coming soon, so stay tuned. Bye bye.